Apparently we both went to Sundance uh, Theater, which is right next to the Great Dane uh, bar here in Madison. And a friend of mine that I was with uh, said, why don't we go to the Great Dane right after we left Sundance? And I thought, no, I don't really feel like going. And I was with some of my friends, and you were with a friend, and we were sitting at adjacent booths. And we were like smiling at each other across the booths. And staring at each other basically. But I didn't really know what to say, it was so loud and I couldn't just get up and go over there and start talking to her. And so he kind of just mouthed, like, what's your name? And so I said, my name's Elizabeth. And he said, oh, he signed to me, he said, um, nice to meet you. So her friends encouraged her apparently to go over to the bar and that's when I had the opportunity to talk to her and I do talk a lot, so. We talked for about two hours. And I got her number and then we set up the date about the first date about a week later. Here I raise my Ebenezer, hither by thy help I come, and I hope I thy good pleasure safely to. I love the way she looks at me. I love how much she respects me. She's the most beautiful woman I have ever met. He knows how to read me very well. If I'm nervous or anxious, he can tell right away and he helps calm me down. Um, and I think I do that for him too. <laughs> he makes me happy all the time. And we can't really be apart from each other for very long without getting really anxious. <laughs> She makes me so happy. I, I have never been so happy in my life.